Hey guys, how are you all doing? It's uh, Juju from Mutants Gamers, and I've got a tutorial on how to install um, MC Patcher on the Mac. And I don't know how some people don't know how to use it. It actually confuses me very much, so how people don't know how to do it. But nonetheless, people have asked for it, and I said I'll do it. So yeah, let's do it. So um, let's say if you're on Minecraft and you open it all up and you've just downloaded a new texture pack uh, which is HD uh, a HD texture pack is anything that's 32 uh, 32 32 by 32 um, pixels on a... I don't know how to put it, I don't know how to say it but if it's got 32 by 32 written on it then it is a HD texture pack and you will need to use um, MC patcher for it so what you want to do first off is you want to go to uh, the link in the description and um, I've just downloaded this and I put it in a little zip file for you so you want to click download and you'll get your little download coming up there click show in finder and then open it all up and you'll get a jar file now oh I've just noticed one minute what I'll do it will actually be called okay sorry sorry about that what it'll be is it'll be called Minecraft uh, 1.5 underscore 01 dot jar. It will be called that. It won't be this. I'll have to rechange that because that's not working at the minute. And um, yeah, so you want to download that. And I'm going to show you what happens if you try and use a texture pack without um, MC Patcher. So let's go ahead and put this texture pack I got, which is HD, and put it into my texture packs folder. So to get to this, what you want to do is you want to go into library. Application support, Minecraft, and then texture packs. And you want to put your HD texture pack inside of there. So let's say if I've got it installed and I'm a, I'm clicking it and Minecraft freezes. If you use if you try and click a HD texture pack whilst uh, not using Minecraft patched, then it will not work and Minecraft will crash like that. So to get it working, what you need to do is you need to delete everything inside of here except from texture packs, stats and saves and last login you need to delete everything inside of this folder um, except from the far I told you and delete them and then open up minecraft now what this does is it deletes all of the mods you have installed because you have to get rid of all your mods in order to use this uh, program so delete everything within your minecraft folder and when you next load, you need to load up Minecraft, and what it'll do is it'll refresh it and it'll download all the stuff you need for Minecraft. So, there we go. And then what you need to do is you need to go and find where you downloaded mcpatcher.jar, and you just double click it, click open, and it should work. Wait one minute, give me a sec, guys. Uh, mcpatcher. Okay, that's cool. One sec, let me just re-download this. I'm having a bit of trouble with this. I'll fix it for you guys, so don't worry about it. So let's just download this. Show in Finder. I'll delete that one. Click Archive Utility. Oh, I'm going to have to do this uber quick and stop it from... Oh, 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 okay. One minute. Let me try that. Oh, the pain. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna do it. Oh, there we go. That was Epic Pro. Okay, what I'll do is I'll just uh, put this up, so you'll just have this file, and you won't have to do all the kerfuffle that I just did. So what you need to do is you need to double click Minecraft Patcher 1.5 underscore jar, click open, and it will bring this up. Uh, you want to click OK, and then it'll have like a little loading bar here, and then all you need to do is click patch. Do this. Close it down, close that down, open up Minecraft, click login, and then you should be able to click your texture pack. And there you go! So now you're able to actually flicker between your HD texture pack and your regular texture packs. And um, sometimes it lags a bit, like mine's lagging a bit, and that's pretty much it. So. Uh, I hope this helps you guys. Um, I love you all to pieces. Uh, if you're having trouble with it, please let me know. And if you get some, oh dear me, if you get some sort of uh, comment on it saying that you need to 
um, or like a huge red box appears with an OK sign. All that means is you need to refresh your cache, which we did at the start. So that's pretty much it. Uh, and I hope I helped you guys. I love you all to pieces, and I hope you have an awesome day. Uh, I'll see you guys in a bit.